What's going on, guys? Chubbs and Seth here with an NBA 2K13 My Player Gameplay. We're taking on the New York Nugget. Oh, I just. New York Knicks. The Knicks. I'm thinking of chicken nuggets right now. I'm hungry. Taking on the New York Knicks. Ooh, that was close. That was almost a slip up. Carmelo Anthony is coming into town. Wants to knock off the Orleans Hornets, which is not too big of a deal because. Right now we're struggling. Chubbs getting a little bit tired of it. He's getting like 10 minutes per game. He's getting a little bit tired of his lack of gameplay, you know. He wants to play. He wants to play in this big time games against teams like the Knicks. He wants to prove that he's good enough to be in the NBA. But right there, he has to take his spot on the bench. So most of the first quarter is up. He finally gets out when New York is up 24 to 9. Really, I mean, beyond all help at this point. I mean, New Orleans definitely struggling. They scored nine points in four minutes. New York throws up three. J.R. Smith, good for three. Makes Dudley bringing the ball up now. He's trying to get anything going. He needs to get this Hornets team going. Trying to step inside, nothing doing. Passing it. Oh, bad pass. Turnover. That's a good way to start out the game. That's a good way to show the coach that you're good enough to start. The Knicks will take it the other way. No good, though. Warwick with the rebound gets it to Chubbs. He's going to bring the ball up again. 40-some seconds left in the first quarter. Chubbs trying to get the offense going. He had that turnover the last possession. He needs a good possession here. He's trying, driving inside. He gets it out to Henry. Moving outside. Nothing doing. Trying to get back outside. He's open for that three. He needs to pop it. Nope, nothing doing. Not going to happen. Oh, what are you doing, Chubbs? What are you doing? The fadeaway? The <laughs> You can't hit that. You can't hit that on the other end. New York's got nothing on us. 15 seconds into the first in the first quarter. Henry gets it out to Chubbs. He's looking for anything. He's got seven seconds to get the shot up. Who's he, What's he going to do? He's going to give it away. He's going to take the shot himself. Driving inside. Kicks it out. Shot up. Good. Hit it. Eric Gordon, I think, was who that was. All right. Coming up to bring up the ball. 425 in the second quarter. Hornets got the ball, eating inside, moving the ball around. Ooh, it's up, it's up, no good, nope. The rebound, nope. Tyson Chandler with the rebound. J.R. Smith bringing the ball up. Chubbs just silent, this is slowly jogging back. He got a good shot defense, though, that's all right. Call for the ball, still down 27-12, still down big. Chubbs trying to get something going. He doesn't have any points yet, he's got that one assist, though. Looking, spinning, uh-oh, uh-oh. Gets it out to Rivers. Rivers tries to get it inside. He's going to pass it out to Davis, who's good. 27 to 14. Here, here we go. Chubbs bringing the ball up, looking for anything. Chubbs calls for the pick, calls for the screen. Here we go. Pick and roll. No, nothing. Gets the shot up. Got it. Good. His first points of the game. Getting on the board now. 32 17 is your score. 2.55 remaining in the first half. B minus teammate great. Waiting for something to happen on defense. Anthony with the ball inside. Shumpert has the ball spinning around, trying to do something cool. Nothing doing. Felton inside the Shumpert with the alley oop layup. McSudley with the ball on the other end. Calls for the screen. He's got the screen. Oh, baseline. Layup. Got it. That's five points for us in the first half. We're playing a little bit more than we have on, than usual. We're feeling good right now, but it's probably because we're so far behind. 34-19, Anthony with the ball. Anthony showing off his dribble moves, his high socks, trying to be cool. Gets inside, layup, good. 36-19, Chubbs subbed in here. In ball, Chubbs with the ball, trying. We gotta get something, we gotta get something going. We gotta have some, a good possession here. And that wasn't gonna be it. Turnover again. Jason Kidd bring the ball up to Smith. That's my guy right there. He missed it. Thank goodness. All right, here we go. Vas Vasquez bringing the ball up court. Chubbs, he's spotting up for three on the line. Warwick gets it out to him. Shot up. Shot good. That's eight points for him now. We're still down by 14. Not even close. But, you know, points are points. Bring the ball up. Chubbs has got it on the outside elbow. Looking calls for that screen from the, out of, like, nowhere. He's trying to get something going. Gets it out to Davis, who drives in for the dunk. 42-24 is your score. 3-40 in the third quarter is remaining. Chubbs, we got eight points this game. And Anthony, he's going to miss that one. Nice job. Bring the ball up. We need points this possession. Nope, everyone's been shut down on our Hornets team. Everyone's been shut down. Nothing good happened in this game. 
All right, Chubbs to Anderson. Anderson to Gordon. Gordon on the outside to Chubbs. Chubbs is open for three. Hit it. Give that to me. 11 points so far in the game. Not too many, but we've been playing a little bit extra. Vasquez bringing the ball up. We're only now 15 now. Chubbs has got to do something. He wants to help his team. He needs to help his team. Trying to drive in. Drives in. He's got some room. He's got room to pop a three. Oh, he's calling for the screen all the way from across the way. Baseline. Contact layup. Good. Hitting it. There we go. 14 points. We're still down 13. That's all right. Come back. Come back time. Here we go. We've got a minute in third quarter. We still got some time to make this comeback. Here we go. Sotomayor to Anthony. Anthony, he's making some moves, driving in hard. Oh, he's not going to get it. He's not going to get that. He, are you kidding me? He's got it. He got it. Anthony is a star. 49-34, 45 seconds remaining in the third quarter. Chubb's bringing the ball up, looking for some good in this possession. He's looking like he might earn some extra playing time on this Hornets team. But like I said earlier in the video, he's getting a little bit fed up with this organization. He's not really liking it here anymore. Getting it over to the Vasquez. Vasquez, he's driving inside. Takes the shot. No good. Should have passed it out. I don't like that shot. I don't like that shot. We're down. And we just get to the fourth quarter. Because it more of the same. Chubb's not playing. And yeah, not a pretty game. I don't even know what the final score was. Like 62-41. Like it was an ugly game. The Knicks destroy the Hornets at home. Chubbs is not happy, but he's not going to say that in an interview, but he's going to be a little bit ticked off. Anyway, so here's that interview. Post game. Not a good game from your team tonight. Is there anything positive you can take from a game with a final score as lopsided as this one? Mm, I don't think so. And why would we want to? You lose a game by a lot, and it's certainly not worth reflecting on. We know we're a better team than that. So I think we just need to file this away, move past it, and start focusing on the next game. It's one thing if you lose by a few points and make a few obvious mistakes, but tonight it was a lot more than that. No sense in getting into all that stuff in any depth unless a pattern starts to form. Then we can talk. Not the best answer there, but he's not happy. We're taking on Charlotte. In a game that we should win in game two of this episode. A game that we should win. Chubbs is a little bit fed up, though. That big loss to New York was, did not make him happy. He was not a happy camper following that game. Hopefully he comes out and makes hopefully he makes a point in this game and proves to the coaching staff that he deserves to play. He wants to play some more. The coaching staff won't give it to him, and maybe it's the defense that gets him on the bench. His boy Sessions just rocked Walked right past him, rocks his offense, and hit that layup. 25-17, Chubbs just running into people. But he's getting that ball out. Oh, Vasquez, you were open for three. Should have taken it. You know what I've learned? If you give the ball to Vasquez, he just keeps the ball forever until you're not open anymore. Wide open, didn't get it. Call for the pick and roll. Is he going to get the assist? Oh, no, definitely not with that. Turnover and sessions. Easy dunk on the other end. All right, Chubbs with the ball. Ten seconds left in the first quarter. Call for that screen. He likes calling for screens. Tries to get inside. Nothing doing. Getting out to Vasquez. Vasquez takes the shot. Got it. Finally hit 1.4 seconds. Remain in the first quarter, and that would end the first quarter. A 10-point ball game. The Hornets are struggling. Down by 10 to the Bobcats. Of all teams, to the Bobcats. We gotta pick this up. We gotta pick this up. Chubbs is definitely not happy, but you gotta—he's gonna at least try to win. Let's go down by ten. Chubbs sprinting up. He's trying to turbo in there. Nothing doing. Spot up three. Got it. Give me that. Thirty-one twenty-four. Defense on the other end. Walker missing that one. Looking for some transition. Chubbs bringing the ball up, nice and slow, nice and easy, setting his offense up. Pa oh, pa oh, I thought he was going to pop that. I thought he was going to pass it to Gordon. Gordon passed it to him. Oh, now he's going to pop it. There we go. Oh, no good. All right, okay. Walker going deep to Williams. Williams, nothing doing. Good shot defense, though, out of Chubbs. And now he's sprinting up court. Transition offense. Trying to get on the board, Chubbs. Oh, he's going to back up. He's got all kinds of space to pop this three. Give it to me. There it is. Hitting it up against. He's got nine points right now in the game. 25 seconds remaining in the third quarter. Chubbs calm for that screen again. He's called for a lot of screens. He goes the opposite way, then goes to the screen. 
What's he going to do now? Pass it inside to Warwick. Warwick trying to get it in. No good. All right. All right. Whatever. Haywood to Walker. Walker sprinting the ball up, trying to get this one into the hoop, trying to make this a bigger lead for the Bobcats before the third quarter ends. Trying to get this end of the quarter cheese. Uh, as Chris Smooth would say, no good, though. Shooting foul, though. All right. Coming into the fourth quarter, sub day. We've only got nine points, and we are down by, like, 16, if my math is correct. Come on, fellas. Come on. Chubbs, he's got to get something going. Pop in the three. No good. All right. All right. Rebound by Iminu. Getting out to Chubbs again for three. Got it. All right. All right. 71-58. 12 points this game. Session is bringing the ball up. We need some defense. All right. Here we go. Chubbs with the ball. He's on. He's He's been hot lately. And another three. Got it. Bringing us within 12. He's got 15 so far. Chubbs bringing it up. He's got 17. He's been hot. He's been making everything another three. Got it. Oh, man. He's been hot this fourth quarter. Bringing the ball up again. Still down, though, by nine pops. Another three. Are you kidding me? Another three. That's 23 points for him. He's got so many threes this quarter. Chubbs, they're down by 13. Just pulling up there. Not a smart shot there. His little streak ends. Along with the game, a 13-point loss to the Charlotte Bobcats. Man, is Chubbs fed up? I'm thinking he is. I mean, he's on he's on the schedule for the GM to have an interview with him. He might get that one pushed up. I don't know. He's not very happy with this loss. Anyway, and you'll hear it in the interview. He's not going to say he's that mad, but I mean, you could kind of tell he's a little bit irked at losing again, I guess. You had 23 points. Although your team didn't get the win, you seem to be making your mark offensively. Is it a little frustrating knowing that you were getting the job done and some of your teammates weren't? Mmm, sorry man. I, I just don't think about it in those kind of terms. Am I frustrated? Yeah. But have I suddenly turned on my teammates? Of course not, man. That's just you guys trying to drum up some drama and find something exciting to tweet about or throw into your next column that no one will read. We'll get it right next time, whether that means I'm scoring a bunch or not. Man, he told that reporter. He told him. I said, though, he's frustrated. He's not going to blame it on his teams, but we got a meeting with the GM. All right. We all know what we're going to ask for. We all know right there. Here we go. See what he says. Hey, man. Uh, I'm not coming in here with a vendetta or to act tough and demand a trade, but I really feel like a change of scenery is what I need for my career right now. You think that request is something you can honor? I'd like to ask you a question if you don't mind. What is the reason behind you wanting to play for another team? Was it something I did? I mean, really, I don't think this team is built to win, man. And winning is really all I'm interested in. To be blunt, I just don't have a lot of time for mediocrity. I see. Well, I'm not going to lie. You were definitely one of my favorite guys on the team here. I had really high hopes for you. I hope you'll reconsider your trade request, but in the meantime, why don't you give me the names of a few teams you'd like to play for, and I'll reach out to their GMs. Do you see that? He's trying to guilt trip me into staying. Anyway, I'm picking my teams here. I'm going with the Bulls because they're actually interested in me. Mavericks, of course, and the Suns would be somewhere I think I could go. So those are my little teams and yes i'm sure there's no way to go back but this is what's going to happen chubbs requesting this okay, trade i'll see what i can do i'll be in touch no doubt all right well uh thank you and uh good talk man i'll, I'll see you later there we go chubbs got his interview with the gm he requested his trade now i'm going to play my next key game and all of a sudden, this happens. So, some good news. I was able to grant your request for a trade. You are now a member of the Dallas Mavericks. I appreciate your service here with us. I think you're a tremendous talent, and I'd love to have you back here someday. Good luck out there. Thanks, man. It means a lot for you to say that. 
You've always done right by me, and I won't forget that. I definitely wish you and the team the best of luck going forward, man. All right, take care.